Hey there, old friend. They had you. This isn't on you. Tarleton didn't even know Monica had me. What? Ade. The heist. Monica hired Taskmaster to steal a Terrigen crystal. His men triggered the security protocols, initiating the Chimera's autopilot. But, <sighs> but that thing in the bay, that was unexpected. The heat signal. It must have been what caused the earthquake that took down the city. What was that? I don't know. Nat, I... I just keep thinking. If I hadn't... All those people... No. This is not your fault. That ship was never supposed to be in the air. I would have done the same thing. You're alive. I knew it! I'm sorry. Um, come on. You should really see this. Welcome back, Captain Rogers. I know I speak for everyone when I say that you are a sight for sore eyes. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to be back. Since the Chimera's near crash into Manhattan, the situation has become dire. I fear AIM will use this as an opportunity to ramp up their persecution of all the Inhumans. We can't let that happen. The world needs the Avengers now more than ever. We are preparing for our final confrontation with AIM. I have completed my analysis of Mr. Stark's plans to equip the Avengers for this anticipated confrontation, and will need some special materials to complete them. Thanks, Jarvis. Time for us to get back in fighting form. Let's see what we need. Excellent, sir. As part of the effort, we might want to help our allies. Commander Hill and Dr. Pym are both reporting serious difficulty in coordinating our efforts due to AIM's draconian control over world communication networks. How can we help? They have requested we destroy AIM's main communication hub to help unite the Resistance efforts. Let's oblige them, old friend. Speaking of the media, Reports of our own Thor Odinson working with ex-AIM scientists in a remote part of Scandinavia have started cropping up on the news. This may be part of AIM's propaganda campaign against the Avengers, but it bears investigation. Agreed. Let's get Thor on this ASAP. We could really use your help. We could really use your help. What do you say? Looking good, Captain. Great to see the old girl in the air again.
the rescue, huh? Now that you're back in action, old Georgie boy's probably losing his mind. He's going to be unpredictable. We need to be ready for anything. How did you guys pull it together after so many years? Honestly, I can thank Kamala. She believed in us, even when we didn't believe in ourselves. Well, she must be something. You and Bruce can be pretty stubborn. Nat, I gotta say, I wasn't surprised you never gave up fighting. Didn't happen without a few stumbles. I almost lost my way like the others. Well, you're here now. I feel better knowing you've got our backs. You know, I always thought your suit was a little over the top, but I have to admit, you make it work. Thanks, Nat. Just as clean and soothing as it always was. Hope we can find out more about Terrigen. I got a feeling we've only just cracked the surface. Bruce? How you been holding up? It was, uh, pretty touch and go there for a while. Kamala really helped pull me out of a tailspin. I'm looking forward to getting to know her more. She's a good one, Cap. Maybe one of the best. Welcome home, Cap. Glad to be here, Bruce. Good to be home again. Gotta get this installed. I'm a bit out of shape. A bit older, but I don't know about wiser. Much better than a cryopod. Ah, my old encyclopedia set. I still can't get used to this internet thing. You'd be proud of what S.H.I.E.L.D. has become. Wish you could be here to see it. Maybe I should ask Thor to help me decorate. <sighs> I got a lot of catching up to do. All hail, brave adventurer. Whatever you may need, I can provide. Thrifty, eh? I suppose it drafts you well. Oof. I gotta get this thing stocked with healthier options. You 
you ever want to try new look, now's the time. I stayed up all night and you didn't buy anything? Such is life. The quiet before the storm. I expect this place will get pretty chaotic when we get to San Francisco. Good to fight by your side again, Captain. The feeling is mutual, buddy. The Avengers have been gone too long. I won't stare. Too much. You're just so gosh darn amazing. Better luck next time, huh? I still remember that epic road trip to Vegas Bruce and I took a few years back. Really should have left the big guy at home. for us to live up to the symbol. We've been gone too long. This is where Monica gave up my location. What's her long game? I have goods for your gold. Okay, I never, ever thought I'd actually get to work with you. Can I say that again? <laughs> well, I'm just a regular Joe from Brooklyn. All uh, right, <laughs> just a regular Captain America. <laughs> I wanted to say thanks. Uh, what for? Well, sounds to me like you're the reason the Avengers are back. And that I'm standing here right now, so... So I wanted to thank you for that. Sure thing. I mean, happy to, um, assemble the Avengers. <laughs> Anytime. So, you ready for this? Yeah. I, I mean, no. Sort of. That feeling never really goes away. You just have to trust yourself and know we'll have your back when you need it. Thanks. <laughs> 